What is going on, guys? Devinator back again. Um, not what I meant to do. We're gonna check the uh, Poke Spot or whatever Spot Monitor. Yeah, I don't know what that means. Um, but we're gonna pick up right where we left off here. Um, where do we gotta go? Where do we have to go? Ah, we have to go back here. I do remember that. But I'm gonna go. That's where we're at. I'm gonna go back to here and check and see if we got anything going on. Maybe we'll find something. Hopefully we do. I'll leave like four fuckers there. Surely something will come to it then, right? I'm gonna go back here. As you guys can probably tell. I'm a little bit stuffy in the head. A little bit not feeling too good. But the show must go on. I hope you all had a wonderful weekend. I did not. I was at work all weekend. So unfortunately, I didn't make the big bucks though. I did make the big bucks. Double time, Sunday, time and a half, Saturday. Good monies, but unfortunately, I did have to spend my entire weekend at the shop. Hopefully, this weekend is a little bit nicer to me. So, we're going to head back over to this place. Because he wants to talk to me about the uh, doodad thing I left him. And hopefully, while we're gone, uh, there's bad trouble, a bunch of shitty characters. There's just hosses. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. All these guys again. I should have healed my Pokemons. It's okay, though. They stand no match for me. But anyways, hope you guys had a great weekend. Starting off the week right. Oh, Monday blues. I feel them. Hopefully, you guys, this helps you get over your Monday blues a little bit more. I know there's technically really no cure for them, but hopefully... Attack here. Oh, fuck. He's a dark type, I forgot. I forgot, Carvana is a dark type of Pokemon. Fiend attack, not very effective, and it's got rough skin. Oh, it didn't, it did not. I can bite it, and then I can... Is Steel super effective against dark? I don't think so. Hopefully this kills. Yeah. So, I've been seeing like, a lot of gameplay of Pokemon Cock version, and this, it looks fucked up, and I kind of want to play it. I'm not sure, though, if I want to or not yet. Uh, just so you know, Steel not very effective against that. I really need to heal my Pokemon, so I'm probably going to do that. Yeah, there's the rough skin. I can't believe it didn't hurt me on Faint Attack. Espeon level up. Still special attacks like outrageous right now. 81. Yeah. She he it's a good mod. It's a good mod. Good pick. Any of them would have been a good pick, but I really want to is there something to heal my Pokemons with in here? I really don't think there is. I really need to go heal them. I don't think they'll make it. So I'm gonna go do that real quick. But uh, yeah, I've been seeing this cock version on my YouTube coming up, and it seems super hilarious. That's the shop. Where's the Pokemon Center? Is this it? Maybe? That's a hotel. Yo! Whatever. So I'm gonna sleep here basically, heal my Pokemans. Okay, so 
I'm gonna check my PDA again. Spot monitor, see if anything's... Nothing still, I guess. Because I really want to catch something. But... Yeah, I really just want to catch something. Like, I'll go fast travel to there now. If I'm at catching something. I'm going to go back in here and fight some more peoples. So I fought this guy. It's locked from this side. Yes, unlock the door. Um, they came and took Meg. Meg is Ned's younger sister. You know, she's her sister. She's her. Okay, so I got to go up the elevator. I'm going to bring it on. You're no match. Took out your buddy, I'll take out you again. I'm taking on many of you. Bring it on, bring it on. I've been trying to promote myself a lot here lately and I've, I've seen good results. Last week we gained like nine subscribers and it was, I was really stoked about that, honestly. Um, that's probably my biggest jump in subscribers that I've ever had with this channel and it's I, I was super impressed I was super happy um, thank you guys for all of your support and uh, I'm still learning things I'm going to be trying some new things out I had a little bit of a technical difficulty I think my Elgato came unplugged from my laptop honestly when I lost my gameplay of my last one so hopefully that uh, doesn't happen again but when I went to start up this episode <sighs> Excuse me. When I went to start up this episode, it did not like it. It did not want to. Um, it did not want to show the screen on the computer, but it would show it up on my monitor, not my uh, laptop. Though. That's okay. I just quick unplug, plug it back in, fixed it. Some hopefully that was all the issue was. But yeah, thank you guys for all the support. I'm trying to make this channel as professional as possible. Mostly because this is something I, I do for fun. I love doing this. I love playing video games, putting it out on the putting it out on the internet, entertaining people. Hopefully, you know, somebody gets some sort of enjoyment out of it. That's the main goal anyway. I am enjoying doing this. I hope somebody's getting enjoyment out of watching this, whether it be a flashback of you know a simpler time when you used to play these games or you know or uh, anything that or like if you're a fan of a series and you're like wow I didn't even know this game existed like this one for example Pokemon XD I, I liked Pokemon series as a kid um, there are fun games to play that you can go back and replay value on them is like you can replay any of them and have a great time they're all super playable. The only one that I'd say is probably not is Gen 1. Which really only because of a... Uh, only because of the fact that there are so many improvements that they made upon from Gen 1. that I think that one is the only one that you don't really need to... And that, and I, I guess a Gen 2 a little bit too. Gen 2 is better, but I think Gen 1 and 2 are the ones that people don't really necessarily need to play back through because they have the remakes of uh, Fire Red Leaf Green and Heart Gold and Soul Silver on the Nintendo DS that you can play right on your 3DS. So, honestly, I think that's... Ghost is super effective against Psychic. I have to keep reminding myself this. I, I set up a Kecleon and that's what I have to do. And I always forget. It, it, that one confuses me. I'm either... I have to double think. I'm like, is, is Psychic super effective against Ghost? Or is Ghost super effective against Psychic? But I think this is right. And I think Psychic super effective against fighting. And it's a shadow Pokemon. So I don't know if, if it keeps its typing. Does it keep its typing? I don't know. Kecleon's getting ready to die. Oh, it didn't die! 
but it is paralyzed now. But I can't use fucking All right, minded espion. I can't use confusion now. I'll use confusion against Makuhita. And I guess I'll just try and do that on Kecleon again. <laughs> yeah, but you guys can probably tell I'm super stuffy. I guess it keep No, no, it's super effective against everything. Shadow type is super is super weak against pretty much everything. I forgot. But yeah, if you guys do enjoy, um, and you think that you have friends on your list that would like it, that, or a Twitter, or, you know, a Facebook page, or a group that you're a part of that would enjoy this content, I, please, share it, I'd get me out there, I'm doing my best, and I would appreciate any of the support that you guys give me, it is all 100% appreciated. But, getting back to the game, we're just gonna keep grinding this out. See what this guy has to say. We're gonna beat all these people in here. Get all the monies we can. Get all the experience we can. Hopefully, there's a Pokemon at one of them blocks, so I can catch that motherfucker. I'm tired of battling with the same ones. I ain't about to go through this whole damn game with an Espeon and a Teddy Ursa, and eventually an Ursaring. If they evolve, I don't even know if they evolve. Mmm, confusion on the duo. Faint attack on Tentacool. This might be super effective, I don't remember. Nope, but it's still fainted. Bring it on, Chimchow. Chimcho. This one I don't really remember. I, I do now that I've seen it, but just by looking at the name, didn't hardly even recognize it. Acid rain. Yeah, oh, it affects both of my Pokemon's. Confusion on Tentacool. I'm gonna try Metal Claw on Chimcho. Hopefully this takes out Tentacool. I don't want to get a poisoning. That's super effective. Sweet. I just don't want to get a poisoning. That would pretty much suck. I don't think this is going to have hardly any effect on it. It didn't, but his attack's going to arise, I think. Maybe. Hopefully. Yeah, his attack rose, so... And it, he's going to growl it and lower his attack, probably. Oh, Espeon? And Teddy Arsha. There they go. So that was a waste. It's okay, though. I'm going to confuse it. Lick. Just in case it happens to be a psychic type don't remember I think it might be it is a psychic type so here comes my ghost type and it should be super effective and it might kill it oh so fucking close just like one HP if I wouldn't have gotten that growl attack it would have died now I can just probably use my like that I can use that and it'll kill it and this refresh I guess it don't matter. Bye-bye. Alright, so we're about 13 minutes in. Uh, halfway through. I'm not going to make this video super duper long. But, I like to keep it around that 30 minute mark. That's what I like to watch. If I watch, I like about 30 minutes. Because if I'm watching, I'm usually either in the... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Um... I, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to that. I'm gonna go to that. I need to go to that. Which one is it? Oasis. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going! I need to get over there. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. No, 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 no. I want to catch this. I got to catch this. I got to go. You big fucking Dumbledore flying in the middle of the fucking thing. A 10 year old kid's gonna go through here and beat all these people. And you Gigantor can't fucking hold them off. 10 year old kid. Granted I have a lot more gadgets than probably the average 10 year old kid in this game. But still damn it. Go 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 go. I have to go to the Oasis. I'm gonna catch this thing. Where is the oasis? Where is the oasis? There it is. 
I'll be so pissed if it's gone. It's a fucking munchlax. Oh my god. Are you fucking serious? Well, at least I got more. Oh, I'm so pissed right now. Oh, I'm so pissed. Please come by and see us now. Please excuse us. Oh, I'm so pissed. Oh my god. I really thought I was going to catch something new. If <laughs> we did. Fuck. Oh my god. I thought we were going to catch something. <sighs> That's super fucking frustrating. Oh, I'm going to go back to the cave and put some extras on it. Oh, I thought for sure we were hatching something new. And then I saw it was a Munchlax. I was like, oh yeah, this is cool. I fucks with the Munchlax. Something different. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. We're probably going to get something like totally gay as shit. Like a fucking... I don't even know. I don't even know a bad one right now off the top of my head. Their magic carp. It's gonna splash around. But at least there'll be something new and fresh on the team. And I don't even know if they I don't know if they evolve in this game. Like Teddy Ursa's 25. 26 maybe. And he's not he's not even like evolving into Ursa Ring yet. So I've pretty much lost all hope that Pokemon evolve in this game, unless you make them, like I did with Espeon. Okay. There's one. N you all have been like one shot kills. Bring it. Uh, I gotta stop recording so late at night. It's like four in the morning. I need to not procrastinate. I keep telling myself that I'm not gonna do this, and I do this every week. <coughs> <coughs> okay. It should be super effective against both of them, so I'm just gonna do that. Really, whatever I do with Teddy Ursa is not really gonna matter, because I really need that confusion for both of them. <sighs> Holy seven. 85 special attack now. They're tanks. I got two tanks. I got one. Mega tank. Alright. And I don't know if it's a boy or girl. I forgot to look. So I think I'm just gonna faint attack Beauty Fly with Teddy Ursa. And we got a one shot Dust Ox. It's a boy. My Espeon is a boy. Dust Ox, one shot, faint attack on Beauty Fly. <laughs> Hopefully this kills both of them. This, I know this one will kill. Dust Ox is dead. dead. My worry is the Beauty Fly. It probably will live. Volpink. This one's probably a Shadow Pokemon. Yeah. I call it. It's because I'm a badass. Well, that's depressing. Hopefully this don't like send out another Pokemon because I don't have it. Okay, confusion to Volpix because that's really all I have. And faint attack on Beautyfly and hopefully both of them kill. I've only been attacking this Beautyfly like forever with it. Teddy Ursa. Can't do shit. At least it's confused. Hopefully it hits itself. Hurt yourself, hurt yourself, hurt yourself. Yes! I've gotten so lucky this series with that. This came through in clutch many a time. 
faint attack. Here we go. That's both of them down. This guy is defeated. Thank God. So I was hoping that we were going to catch something, but uh, nope. Okay. What do we got over here? Got anything for me? Freaky thugs out with some other. Can you imagine and everything? Got anything in here? Nothing in here for me? Alright, alright. You got anything in here for me? Yep. You're a doll. I see a pretty face too. Blah, blah, blah. Attack me. Bring it. Alright. You're getting nowhere. Alright. We're gonna win. You leave these people alone. Quillfish and a Rhyhorn. That's a weird combo, but okay. I fucks with it. Gen 1 and Gen 2 action right here. The Quillfish and the Rhyhorn. I know some of my generations of Pokemon, okay? I know some things. I'm gonna confuse the Rhyhorn and uh, do the licky lick to Quillfish. Hopefully I'll paralyze it. I know I won't kill. Oh, Rhyhorn did not eat that like I thought it was going to. Bye bye! Teddy Ursus is getting ready to level up. Sweet. Chin Chow. That's a. Uh, it's Gen 2 also, alright. So he's got the water type Gen 2s on his team. So this guy's like a Gen 2, not a Gen 1. -er. It's a critical hit. It's a critical hit. Come on. There we go. That's what we wanted. Confusion to Chin Chow. And then um faint attack on Quillfish. This should be healed. Oh, no. No, man. Fan attack. Alright, good. Decent. Decent. Poof. Blasted me. Bullfish is paralyzed. That's what we like to see. Quick attack to Chinchow. Fan attack to Quillfish. This should kill both. Hopefully, he's got no more. Alright, because I'm trying to move. We got like four minutes left in this episode. Alright. Four minutes. Coughing. Shit. Shadow Pokemon? No. Okay. Hopefully he doesn't have any more and coughing is just all, all he wrote. Please don't throw out anybody else. Thank you. Fusion, because it's already faster than it, and then a uh, vein attack. These, this combination should kill. If confusion doesn't kill, this combo should kill. Fusion killed it. I figured it would. Psychic's like super broken in this game too. So definitely picking Espeon was the right move here. All right, let's see where we can get from here. That guy's out of here. Already checked there. I thought I already found that. I guess not. But I found it this time. So whatever. So I found that. I'm gonna go up this elevator. I'm so pissed that we didn't fire anything on a pokey spot this episode. I thought we had a munch lax, but we didn't. So I found a revive. I, th I swear I thought I found all this. So I'm gonna battle this. Oh. Bring it on. I'm saving everybody. Hey. To the pit of misery. Dilly dilly. You're going to die. Gen 2 and Gen 3. Mareep and Gulpin. I'm like strictly a Gen 2-er. Teddy or said is beyond. Um, I'm more afraid of this. But I also want to get rid of that Mareep. I don't want to get paralyzed. But I don't want to be poisoned. And I want to get it out of here. 
I don't want to get poisoned, and I know that thing will poison you. I don't want that. Love disc. Here's some Gen 3 love. Love. Get it? Love a disc. Love. Yeah. Hopefully it paralyzed the Mareep. Nope. Thunder Shock. I'm not like really surprised on how good this game actually looks. For it being as old as it is, I'm like really shocked. Um, really shocked at how awesome this game looks. It's unbelievable. Critical hit. Love disc is down. No love for the love disc. Sorry, brother. You out. Damn. This guy's got like a full squad. I got like two. So that should be able to take out Marie with one more hit. Tackle Teddy Ursa. Teddy Ursa's about to die. Alright. Abel Awesome is a pretty decent, pretty decent level, but Confusion should kill. Ah, oh, Confusion didn't even like do half. Not good. Faint attack. This should kill. This should kill. Reap dead. Dead. So we'll probably wrap up this video after this battle. And we got a little bit farther today. We uh, got our surprise fake Munchlax. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give my end credits here so we can get out of here and so you can get on with the rest of your day but uh thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate all the support and if you guys do enjoy be sure to check out the description i'll be leaving links to my twitter and facebook page uh be sure to give both of them a like for you know anything related to this channel news wise i post some of my collection stuff there or if you're just interested in keeping up with me in another way, be sure to check the description out. I'll have the links there. Um, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you all are new. And I think that's all I got for you guys. Hopefully you did enjoy episode 9. We will see you again on Friday with Need for Speed and Most Wanted episode 6. I do believe we're going to be on... And then next week we'll be on episode 10. Um, and be sure to stick around. Uh, if I get any spare time, I will be trying to do a live stream. Maybe a, a game tour, game room tour. I'll do something. <laughs> but I hope you guys have a great rest of your Monday. And I'll see you.